Hey everybody. I thought I would come on here with you and let you know for Christmas, I bought myself an easy bow maker and I have not opened it up yet because I'm so used to doing bows by hand, but I watch all these amazing videos of these people that do them with the bow makers. And I thought, you know what, let me give that a try. So I thought maybe we could unbox this together. So I got the Deluxe Easy Bow Maker and I thought, well, let's unbox it together and see what's in it and then set it up and then I will make a bow with you, okay? So whenever I open this up, I am going to slide this out. Oh, look at that. Okay. And then we have these little guys, little dow, uh, dow rods. And then, of course, it comes with your nifty instructions booklet. Do you read the instructions on new items? I have to admit, sometimes I do and sometimes I don't. Okay, so whenever I kind of flipped through this, if you notice, there are different tutorials, bow tutorials in here. Um, and, and it tells you exactly what to do for each one of them. But what I thought we could do is just make one of the bows that I typically make. So let's set this up and then I will create another video and we'll actually make a bow together. Okay. So I have a couple of different dowels here and I am going to, let's just see, it says dowels are labeled um, larger than holes to create a press fit, use a hammer to assemble. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I've already started hammering the first one in. You literally have to pound it a little bit. And then I'm going to take my next dowel and I'm gonna hold it right here. And I'm gonna hammer that one in as well. Okay. And there goes the ribbon. Okay, then I have a small dowel that I want to hammer in. I probably should have done that one first. Okay, so here's what we have so far. We have one, two, and then a small one. And then over here is where your spool goes or your ribbon. So I'm gonna hold that one. So now we've got it together. Come back and join me and let's make a bow together.